Hi friends, today we are going to develop the use case diagram for the social networking sites. This is the use case diagram for the social networking site. We are having the user and admin. These are the actor and these are the use case. That is the top view of the system. Now we are going to develop the use case diagram. Just go to the rational rules. Open the rational rules. <coughs> We are not going to the package, include the packages, so cancel this one. Right click on the use case view, go to the new, select the use case diagram. This is social networking site, so you can name it. Social networking website. Double click on this file name what the name you have given okay it will appear use case diagram use case view and social networking websites okay it may be any website facebook and other social networking website to develop the diagram maximize this one you can minimize this one as per your requirement okay when you will select the use case diagram uh, use case icons will be displayed on this pane. Okay. Now we will start to develop the diagram. For this one, first we will make the actor. That is, actor is user. Second actor is admin. These are the two actors for the social networking website. Now we will develop the use cases. First, we will develop the send friend request. Send friend request. We will add uh, one more use case. Post. This is the extra use case we are taking. Next, register profile, edit profile. Just click on the icon and drag it here. Edit profile. Check user account. Delete user profile. Send the by receive messages. Make system announcement, release system update. release system Indeed. next 
send user warning suspend user account use cases upload photos post messages make the association the user will register the profile the user can edit his or her profile the user can check the detail about his account user can send and receive messages user can upload the photos he can post the messages on his timeline he can report in appropriate method he can start for the instant messaging okay admin can register the profile admin can edit the profile admit can check the user account admin of the group is able to delete the user profile admin can make the system announcement just drag and drop admin can release the system updates admin can issue the warning to the user for inappropriate messages or content admin can suspend the user account user can send the friend request and user can post on the timeline of friend the use case post on timeline is depend upon the friend request after the approval of the friend request he can post on the timeline this dependency is actually include dependency without confirmation of the friend request he cannot post on his timeline so this dependency we need to select the dependency we are having the three arrows one is association second is dependency and third one is generalization that is we should know the concept of object oriented programming so to inform about this dependency go to the open, open specification select the u stereotype include apply okay okay so in this one in include send friend request include post on timeline this meaning is that if you want to post on the timeline of your friend you should connect with the friend 
this is all about the top view of the system of user profile if you want to write the name of the system just click here facebook use case view or use case diagram you can add more use cases as per your requirement so this is all about the social networking websites use case diagram that is the top view of the system we are having the two actors user and admin and these are the use cases of the top view of the system how they are interacting with the system we can make you can make the bidirectional also uh, arrows also as per your requirement if you want to make the bidirectional arrow you can make you can click on here suppose that some activity it is coming from the use case to the actor you can do this thing also send or receive the messages click on the send or receive messages use case and drop it to the user same thing for the admin also just drag and drop you will get the bidirectional arrows okay it's only for understanding for to the developer that right? the message is from bidirectional you can save the diagram and to check the access violation just go to the report click on the access violation if there is any access violation that is if you have not followed the fundamentals of the object oriented programming it will show you the access violation otherwise you will get the information no access violation found that is your diagram is validated now thank you for watching the video you can subscribe the videos to my channel